guys. What are you doing over there? You're on the ground. Yeah, this is a lot better. You guys not on the ground anymore. I hope you can hear me. It is really windy. All right. What do you guys think I'm doing today? We're going to put up some electric fence. Yep. Got the fence rig put up. I just keeping my seat warm. So yeah, going to start right here. That fence right there is no so bueno for sheep. So we're going to put a two strand electric fence up this road. Let's get to it. All right, we're gonna start off by tying our two strands to a post, then we'll pull them out, put it up. Okie dokie. Got these strands tied off right there. That'll hold. Let's roll this fence out. I'm rolling along here, rolling this fence off the back of the trailer. I'm throwing out posts as we go. So when we get to the end, we'll just tighten everything out, come up. So when we get to the end, we'll just tighten everything up, uh, put the posts in and it'll be set. Yep, pretty much. We'll just keep rolling some fence and posts out. It's pretty windy up here, hope you can hear this. But there we go. That's what she looks like set up. There's a trick to this. Getting these wires set just right. You want to set the bottom one close enough to the ground that as they're grazing, they'll run into it with their nose and shock them on the nose. And the second one, the top one, you want it up high enough that they'll hit it with about their forehead if they're just walking. Uh, as you'd guess, sheep have wool. Wool's a pretty good insulator. It won't let much shock through it. So your best place to get them is on their nose, their ears. Uh, I guess their legs have hair too, but if their head's already over the fence, they're going over it. So yeah, got this section put up up there to the four-wheeler. Now we're gonna go turn where the four-wheeler's at and go north that way with the section. Then we'll be ready to turn some sheep out. Yahoo! We got her done. Fence is done. Getting ready to turn bucks out. Don't... Don't judge my apparatus here. You see three still posts? Yeah, there should have only been two, but... This post and that post, I shouldn't have put one next to each other. You see these solar panels? They both got to have sun. I left one behind the other. That solar panel was not getting any sun. So yeah, kind of like these little solar panels. We used to pack batteries and yeah, not fun. Technology's awesome sometimes. So got that. Right here, we got our hot wire going down. Hooked up here. I got a jumper wire down to the bottom wire. That should run enough electricity for these bucks. Uh, same on this side. I ran two chargers, one going each way, because I want quite a bit of juice in it. But, yeah, there you go. We got the fence put up. Now let's move some bucks. Well, hello. We're doing it. Turning out the sheep. Got the fence built. Grass is growing. 
Let's turn out some bucks, huh? Driving down the old railroad grade. This is a railroad grade? Yeah, a train used to go down this road. Not anymore, though. Yes. Got Indian Dow Dow helping me. We've got one load turned out. Turning out another. We've got 26 turned out. Indy says we got 30 on this trailer. I hope so. Let's get done quicker. Probably got four, maybe five loads to come here. They look happy and green. They'll turn them loose. These bucks are happy. Like I said, they've been on feed since like October. Turn them loose, in. You ready to count them? Ooh, that's a load. They're falling out. One, two, three. I got them. four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten, eleven, twelve, thirteen, fourteen, fifteen, sixteen, seventeen, eighteen, nineteen, twenty, twenty-one, twenty-two, three, four, five, six, twenty-seven, twenty-eight, twenty. 30! Ah! We did it! We got 30! Good job, Ben. What's 26 plus 30? What's 3 plus 2? Yeah, come look. 3 plus 2 is what? Five and a six. What does a five and a six make? No, together. That's my. Indy, she's getting tired. She's got three gates to open. Each way we go. Open and close. Like, yeah, she's getting tired. It's good for her though. Told her I'd pay her like five bucks. Like, okay, I'll do it. It's a good idea. All right, we'll back up here to the load and shoot. Load another load. Just watching in the mirror. See how good I can back up here, huh? I don't know if I'm that good, especially one-handed. Backing up, backing up. All right. That's what we got left least two more loads. Got to sort off some fat lambs we got in here. We're going to keep them in. We'll keep them on corn. Get them good and fat so we can eat them. Yeah. See if we can get 30 on. I don't know. Taffy, she's over there. Horses are Ooh, the gate. One of our rubber mats. That's the problem. Yeah. See this rubber mat? It got moved. Door won't open very good with that rubber mat in the way. Alright, we're going to load these without loading lambs. And video. One, two. It is time. guys yes the chicken coop's not finished by no means at all but it is fixed enough to turn chickens loose we got feed water old chickens it is time to put the newborn chicks in i've been waiting for this day for two months ever since i got them Hello, chicken, chicken, chicken. <laughs>
right, number nine, turn loose. They're very happy. They've lived in a box, cardboard box, and a tiny little crate for two months. It's the most room they've had. Grow me some eggs, chickens. Grow me some eggs. Come on, let's go for a ride. Let's go check on those bucks and those sheep we turned out yesterday. Let's go check on some grass. See what's going on. It's gonna be fun. Hang on, might be a little bumpy. Grass is growing. Found them. They're up here on salt, just hanging out. <laughs> Glad to find them though. Pretty green grass. Alright guys, I think that'll do it for this video. Hope you had fun, hope you learned something. I didn't. Like and subscribe, keep watching.